normally when you make a tetrahedron, the larger you make them, the more difficult they get. In this case it's the other way around. This is the most difficult one to make because of major major polarity problems at the end. This one also has big polarity problems at the end. Still it's a little easier and if you want to make it even easier then leave out the central dot in the fourth layer. This one is also tough to make, especially the end face, but the internal is much easier. For making the small one, start with a little hexagon, go around it. And make 3636. Three, six. Add single balls in a symmetrical triangle. this. Now fold this inward around these balls. Squeeze them inside. So that you get this shape. Now Circle around again with 6, place 1 inside 7, use another 6 to make a triangle, place a triangle on top. And finish that one with another one. Move it around a little bit till it stays. This needs a different polarity. So turn the coil around now remove the center ones and already it starts to look like the little one. Now there's a problem here to fix that. Try to gently. This one is not cooperating. goes. Remove it like that and then place it back with different polarity. As you can see this gap is closed now. Let's try this gap.
reforest. That polarity and now this gap is closed although there is a, a little problem with this one that needs to come out a little bit here is still a problem to be fixed It didn't work out so well, but anyway, this is the way to get it, and it's tough. For making the one in the center, you start with 2 by 8, and one hole in the center. The second layer is 2 by 7, and a triangle cut out in the center. Place them on top of each other. Now the third layer start with 12 place three on top and two on top and repeat this place it on top now add the single balls in the center like that try to add a fourth on top then place three and another two, three, Another two, now place a two by four on top. Place a 2x3 on top, place a 2x2 two two on top, the method that works the best for making these edges is to remove two rows of magnets and then to start building tunnels and when you do this for larger tetrahedra it doesn't work anymore, but at least for this size it does. Now close it. Put one on top here. Now all you need to do is to finish the top.